All right, what's up? I'm gonna be talking about the monster leveling order today. So right after you install the game, um, get your 60 free summons. Uh, I believe you're guaranteed to get Teddy, Speedy, Mighty. Um, you, you usually get lucky enough for like a Stacky or yeah, some sort of carry, Stacky, and Furnace, you know, maybe a Puffy, Kevin, if you're really lucky, Frostbite also works. A lot of different carries that work. The main thing that you need to know is that you have Speedy and Mighty. And so starting from the King stages, you want to prioritize your gold into Mighty, right? He's going to be um, your method of progressing through a lot of the game. It's going to be very useful um, because his ability is just really, really strong early on. Um, and then, yeah, you upgrade Mighty, you upgrade Speedy. Those are your first two leveling priorities. And then if you find that you're having a little bit of an issue uh, going past a particular level or a particular set of levels, um, you can upgrade whatever your, whatever carry you're using instead of Mighty Speedy. Uh, I believe, yeah um mighty is a little bit more important than speedy i'd say but um yeah some carries you could use again stacky you could upgrade him uh again in furnace uh you know it could probably work out with you know frostbite puffy um kevin just generally yeah, not expensive units unless they are mythics right because um stuff like the archangel stuff like felina you know it's they're not like the mythics where you can upgrade them to like level 10 they'll be able to uh easily easily carry you um, and they also cost, you know, a bit more gold, right? Um, and yeah, af after you get your uh, Mighty Speedy and your carry leveled, um, you're going to move into, yeah, Rage Fist Normal. You're going to move into JR Normal. So after beating JR Normal, your priorities are going to be Slime King, Mighty Speedy. Um, you don't really want to upgrade the carry you're using before, even if he is a Kevin. Slime King is just, you know, generally better. You can focus your gold on Kevin later, but uh, you focused on him for now, just so you could get past JR Normal, right? Um... From this stage of the game, again, Mighty, Speedy, Slime King. Uh, keep leveling until you go through JR Hard. And after JR Hard is when the uh, the gold farming is going to start to set you up for beating these Nightmare levels. Um, so you can start getting, you know, more Mythic Red Gems. Um, and so at this stage in the game, you want to look to upgrade. Uh, if you do have a Mythic, ideally, the most ideal Mythic is Jiraiya. He is the uh, best unit in the game for Speedy gold farming. Um, overall, yeah, pretty strong. But if you have any Mythics, now would be a good time to upgrade them. Get them to probably around the level 400 mark. Uh, they can clear through the Nightmare levels with you with a max speedy, max mighty. Um, you know, if you don't have a Mythic, you don't have access to any Mythic at all. Um, and you, you're having trouble getting one. Uh, instead, what you can try and go for is a uh, Flamey and Clyde. You just upgrade these guys because they'll really speed up your gold farming, right? I believe, you know, the combined cost of two of them is like... 2 and 45 of the cost of expensive unit something like that um anyways yeah com compared to um the expensive units that you're going to be upgrading for the nightmare levels such as felina uh you know you just upgrade clyde flamey uh put a speedy in between them um you know just replace this amaterasu here with like clyde replace this giant with flamey um get them to high enough level where they're one-shotting most stuff and they'll be able to farm jr for you pretty quickly um and then yeah farming gold with those guys you then go for felina um and that's felina is going to be your main carry for clearing the nightmare levels to get red gems if you don't have any mythics already um and that's kind of like two upgrade paths branching out you know whether you have a mythic whether you don't have a mythic um but yeah af after that after you are able to get nightmare level clears just so you are able to claim the uh, weekly achievements you know these are really important because mythics are going to be your entire setup in elemental challenges right so you need mythics um and i'd say you know to have an easy time in uh or to even have a chance in the end game levels you need um i'd say pretty much every mythic except for poseidon hades you know maybe a raw um because he's only useful for iqt right um yeah from there you want to go for uh you want to go for any sort of like cheap monsters just so you can farm evil summoner i have a video with a link to the specific levels required for them to one shot small golems but yeah after after you are able to clear the nightmare levels with whoever is your carry um, you just go for every single monster in the game to 400, except for the uh, super, super expensive ones. You know, these Archangels here, um, you know, some specials. Uh, and yeah, doing that will just allow you to farm Evil Summoner a lot more easier. Uh, get more Power Stones, so you can go for level 500s. You know, if if this if you're getting stuck on like a Nightmare level, um, even with a Mythic or, you know, maybe with a Felina, you need Power Stones, you know, would be a good time to... Put some gold into uh, cheaper monsters so you can farm evil summoner more easily um after that you know the only thing left to upgrade really is uh you know other mythics if you haven't upgraded them yet and special units 
Um, from there, you just want to take a look at what uh, what units are going to be used in specific elemental challenges. I'm going to make a video on those after I am able to obtain decent endgame setups. But, you know, some of those non-mythics that are really good for specific spe special challenges include stuff like uh, Blue Archangel, Yellow Archangel, you know, Deathbite is good, Archimedes is strong, uh, Hellhound is probably the most important unit in the game for the endgame, uh, and Blitz Charger can also be good. Um... But yeah, that's that's pretty much the general leveling order. Um, you're just looking to uh, go to JR Hard as fast as possible, utilizing Mighty Speedy, um, and then from there, uh, you're just looking to uh, to upgrade whatever will help you clear a nightmare level. From there, you're looking to upgrade all your units that are cheap to be able to farm Power Stones with Auto more efficiently. Um, yeah, and and then from there, uh, you just go on upgrading stuff with Gold and Power Stones for your uh, for your elemental challenges. Um, yeah, it's gonna be it for this video. Uh, this is a remake of a video I had before. Uh, not sure if this is better or worse, but I'm gonna keep this up anyways. Um, also trying out, you know, new mic settings. Let me know if this is good. Let me know if this is bad. If I need to change anything, uh, I might try to start, you know, editing videos soon. And then we'll definitely try to post endgame content after I do get Hellhound. It's gonna be it. Uh, like, subscribe, and uh, see ya.